This is question number 11 of 2020 KCSE Mathematics Paper 2. We are told in an experiment involving two variables, time t, hours and height, uh, and height h centimeter, the following results were obtained. So we have time in hours, uh, 0, 0 0.7, 1.5, 2.1, 2.8, 3.2, 3.6 so the corresponding 182 64 46 32 18 and 10 on the grid provided brought t h where t is a time h h is a height and you get one mark use a plotted point to draw the best line of fit for the data and hence determine the rate of change of height with time so we are going to use this table already we have the grid here we have t height on the y-axis and we have time on the x-axis so we start with the first set when t is zero the height was a hundred so we put our mark there uh, when t is 0 0.7 uh, 0 0.7 these are 10 units so 0 0.7 there we have 82 so here is 0 0.7 uh, here it is 10 unit so it means 82 is one unit you have our point there then when it is 1.5 this is 1.5 uh, it is 64 so here it is 1.5 64 is that mark uh, when it is uh, 2.1 this is 2.1 uh, uh, the height was 46 so 46 we have 2.1 this is where we have 46 uh, then we have 2.8 2.8 is here the height is 32 so 32 is here and 2.8 uh, 2.8 is there uh, when it is 3.2 3.2 is here it is 18 so 3.2 uh, 18 is there uh, then we have when it is 3.6 it is 10 3.6 is here we have it is 10 there uh, so with that we can now uh, be able to join uh, we have uh, on the grid uh, where t on the grid brought t so with that we have done that so from there we now use the, pr the protected points to draw the line the best line of fit means you draw a line that passes through uh, uh, majority of these points and near these points so if we plot uh, that we can see now that 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 line passes through majority of the points uh, so that is the best line of fit and it is near the majority of the points as you can see uh, now we are supposed also hence determine the rate of change uh, of height with time so we can take two points we can this is a very clear point uh, we have um, we have t is zero and uh, height is a hundred so that is one point this one then we can check another point let's take 2 and 50 so we have 2 and 50 so we can use those two points to get the rate of change uh, of h with time so uh, uh, rate of change of h with t Uh, let's put that properly with t is equals to uh, we take 100 minus 50 you divide by uh, 0 minus 2 uh, this will be uh, uh, this will be 50 uh, divide by minus 2 which is equals to minus 25 so we can say it is minus 25 uh, centimeter per hour meaning that the height is reducing at the rate of uh, 25 the minus means reducing centimeter 
uh, pa, pa, pa lava. So that is how you uh, get that. So that's how you solve that question and you'll be able to get three marks.